type of shark? Bull? No. Nerf? No. Lemon? Yeah, see the yellowish color? Oh yeah, I can really see it on the camera. Yeah. That took a little while to get them on board. Yeah. Yeah. Um, guys, one thing about this shark, he is blind. In both eyes. Both eyes. He is freaking blind. Look at this. This eye can't see. And let me get to the other side. I'm just gonna be super careful here because I don't feel like being shark soup. But look, look at this eye. This shark is completely blind. So basically, he used his senses, you know. He had to have used just his sense of smell. I don't know if you can see up close all these little dots up here. These pores are called ampullae. So in addition to the shark's keen sense of directional smell, these pores can detect small amounts of electricity generated by muscle movement of the fish that they're hunting. It is a beautiful limit shark. And somehow he's out here surviving, finding food. So I'm gonna get him back in the water. Hopefully he can uh, continue to eat and uh, find food because uh, that's crazy. A blind shark. All right, had this thing out of the water for about two minutes now. About two minutes. Um, let's try to get him back in and uh, get him revived. Oh, oh my, oh. Well, he's ready, shoot. Whoa, he still got some power. Maybe I should have let him sit out a little bit longer. <sighs> Man. That scared that me. I almost broke my finger. So, uh, yeah, that shark, I mean, I got some stinky bait out, but blind in both eyes. One is just kind of glazed over, the other one is like almost just completely gone. Yeah. I didn't realize he still had that much energy, man. He was just playing, uh, playing Dad. sleepy time for me. It's one thing I, I don't really like having him on board, you know. I'll let Mike do it, but uh, I'm more comfortable just getting the hook out and uh, releasing them. But I had to look at his eyes, man. That was that was crazy. I noticed it before we had landed him, so I I, I figured, you know what? Let me bring him on board, show you guys. Man, I don't know. Maybe it has something to do with the power plant down here, the nuclear power plant, because I know that there's like other fish and there's like snook that got cancer. So. Uh, you never know. Crazy times, right? How do fish get cancer? Uh, honestly, I'm not sure. I'd have to talk to a marine biologist about that one. Uh, maybe we can get one on the show one day. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, I'm tired. Are you tired? Yes. Yeah? All right. Let's wrap it up. Yeah. All right, so it's about 7 o'clock, you know, 7.15. Sundown is at uh, 7.59 today, so we're going to head back in. Got a little uh, work to do on the motor still. I can hear some an air leak somewhere, a vacuum leak. So I'm gonna have my mechanic check that out. You know, Danny at KNJ Marine. So uh, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode, Lexi. You like riding out in the boat now? Yeah. Yeah. You want to do it more often? Yeah. I think we gotta get Lexi on some uh, bonefish and some permit now. What do you guys think? Also, remember to subscribe and hit that notification button. Bye. I forgot to say that. Peace out, deuces. I got my horses in the back, sharks in the back. <sighs>